Federal Rule 11 fulfills its mission through three distinct but interrelated mechanisms, all of which we'll cover in this tutorial. They are, one, it requires anyone filing a paper with the court, such as a complaint, brief, or motion papers, to sign it so that the court knows whom to hold responsible for the content of the paper. Two, it requires that A, the paper not be filed for an improper purpose, B, the paper must either accurately represent the law and relevant authorities, or must set forth a non-frivolous argument for changing the law. In other words, the legal arguments must stand a reasonable chance of success at the time they are made, even if they don't ultimately succeed. C. At the time the paper is filed, the party filing it must have an objectively reasonable basis for concluding that the factual assertions in the paper have evidentiary support, or will have evidentiary support, after the parties have had a reasonable chance to gather evidence. And three, it imposes sanctions for violating the requirement of number two, so that there are real consequences for filing frivolous papers. Once we've covered these materials, we'll conclude with a short quiz to test your understanding.